Huge turnout for fallen trooper Aaron Pelletier. The wake for Trooper Pelletier is being held right now in Southington. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Susan Raff is live at a funeral home where friends and family are arriving right now. Susan. Kara, good afternoon. This is a very sad day for people here in Southington. It's also going to be a day of long events. This is the wake that you're looking at right now for Trooper Aaron Pelletier. It just started right now, and you can see people lining up, waiting to get in. The American flag is draped over many state police vehicles. Now, because they're expecting so many people in town today, this part of Main Street is closed. In fact, many of the smaller roads off Main Street are closed today because of the anticipated traffic. We should also let you know that Southington schools are closed today because of this traffic issue. The funeral will be in Hartford tomorrow. Now, Trooper Aaron Pelletier was killed by a hit and run driver last Thursday. He was doing the job that he loved. He was pulling over someone on the side of 84 eastbound when he was struck and killed by a hit and run driver. He leaves behind a wife, Dominique, and two young boys, Zachary and Troy, ages three and five. Trooper Pelletier was only 34 years old. And this is particularly difficult for this community because Trooper Pelletier grew up in Southington. He went to school here. He raised his family here. This is also a very strong community. We've spoken to many people over the last few days who have been really doing what they can to help this young family, collecting food for some of the troopers who have been stationed or camping out outside the family's home, spending time with them. Also, donations for the family. And coming up later on Eyewitness News, you will understand how important this trooper's life was to this community. As for the funeral, that is going to be held tomorrow at the Xfinity Theater in Hartford. Southington schools will be open tomorrow, but there will be an early dismissal. We are live this noon in Southington. Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.